<laughs> Hello. What's poppin'? Oh. <laughs> hey guys. Copes, nobody's talking to you. <laughs> Ow, stop, please. Hey, who's that? I see one person. Who's that? Who's that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, God. Here we go again. This very bad connection. Here we go. It's not on the internet. It's freaking slow. Hey, guys. Hey, True. Hey, Sharni. I think that's how you say it. Tony, who else? Miss Monet, the Forever Family. Hey guys. Oh, all right. I think I'm gonna turn that off. Hey Jess. Cass, who was that? Not one, Tanya, Sade. Oh, everybody wish the Forever Family a happy birthday. Happy birthday. Uh, uh. Millie Rock. Mm. I don't know how to do it, so, you know. <laughs> don't laugh at me. <laughs> hey, do a little dad for her birthday. <laughs> hey, Rochelle. Hey. <laughs> hey, Erica. You got to wish um the Forever Family a happy birthday. It's her birthday today. Oh, y'all is popping. Y'all popping today. Yeah, um, true natural beauty. But I, you know, I oh, call yeah. it true. Yeah. She's pregnant too. Mm. <laughs> it's uh, the Forever Family right underneath of you. It's her birthday. Hope y'all don't mind. I'm having my coffee right now. These uh, live streams getting real regular. <laughs> so what's going on, guys? It's Wednesday. Once again, we here. How's everybody doing today? Oopsie. I think I might have to put it like this. Of course. You know we got you, girl. Trying to get a good spot here. There we go. Struggling at work after the holiday. I know. Um, my fourth was pretty good. Um... I just yeah. hung out with my mom and my dad. We watched a bunch of movies. We saw the fireworks. We had pizza. Like, it was just, like, real chill. Um, <clears throat> if you guys have watched my vlogs, you know that over by the pool, it's, like, a bunch of grills and stuff like that. But, um, <laughs> yeah, it definitely does. Um, but it was just a lot of people, you know, already over there trying to get their spot grilling and stuff like that. So we grill all the time. So it wasn't like it was a necessity to grill on the 4th. So we just hung inside and had a good time all together. So what did you guys do? I know some people still get to be off like the day after or something like that. Um, back when I was working at the Marriott. I was either able to get the day before or the day after off. But I had to work one of those three days. 
and I end up normally working on the fourth and was probably off I think the day after which was good for me but um somebody else already said they back to work already so you grew up with some girlfriends that's what's up I love spending time with girlfriends July. Yeah, it's a paid holiday. Right? Yes. Yeah, it's a paid holiday. Okay, Rochelle, you hung out with some girlfriends too. Oh, you worked yesterday? Dang. Yeah, I normally would work on it every year. Like, I was never off uh, because I worked at a hotel, so we rarely close. You know, hotels are open nine times out of ten every day. Um, so... I think I worked every 4th of July, too. I was either off the day before the day after. Um, I didn't get paid time and a half. I wish I did, though. Dang. I was off relaxing. I'm in the UK, so I didn't know. Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> it's just a regular day for you. I'm English. I didn't know what 4th of July is. Oh, yeah. It's a American holiday. <laughs> not really a good history if you think about it but people still celebrate it um i got my hair braided testing and style okay you got like straight back you got um box braids like what kind of braids did you get hey gia what's up girl who's that hey what's going on you look like a new name miss thomas you air dry and you loved it. Which product did you use, Erica? <laughs> Sound like you probably used Pantene if it took forever. I stuffed my face <laughs> with your feet up. You allowed to do that because you got a baby in there. You're allowed to do that. A uh, updo. Oh, okay. Let me go back and see. A 15 hour shift. Oh my God. Girl, more power to you. Mm -mm. I hope you were sitting down for that 15-hour shift. Um, Carol's daughter, milk leaving, and eco styler. Okay. So, yeah, I that's like the best way, I think, to use that eco styler to put a, a leave-in underneath. It took forever for you? Wow. I don't remember my hair taking long um, to dry. Hey, Lady Smash. This is one of the contests, I mean, the giveaway winners, guys. Um, I think, is this your first time joining us in the live stream? I think so. I don't think I've seen your face, your name before. I say your face, but you know what I meant. Because, <laughs> I mean, I feel like I see y'all face because, you know, y'all got your uh, pictures up. I want to see you use the new Camille Rose Lavender products. Ooh, okay. Oh, okay, she's new too. What's your name? Let me see. Hold up. Let me scroll back down. Shazaya? How you say it? I think Shazaya J. She's new too, guys. This is her first time joining us. Oh, okay. It's your second time. Um, security at a nursing home. Oh, okay. All right. I used to work at like a rehab center, which is kind of like similar in a way. Um, cause it was like long-term stays too. So it kind of felt like a nursing home. <laughs> um, um, I heard they were at Sally's, the, uh, Camille Rose line. I don't know where Sally's is here. I'm still, uh, learning the area. I just found this really nice beauty supply store. Um, and they have a lot of stuff. So that's like going to be one of my go-to's. Because uh, we're doing Lotta Body. So tomorrow I'm going to go pick up the Lotta Body products for this week's video. Uh, love to Pantene. Oh, yeah. So let me touch on that, y'all. <laughs> the Pantene did not last on your boy. Okay. That lasted like two days. That was it. And I, I want to touch on this, too. Because a lot of you guys have been asking me to do, like, um, 
a follow up or make the video longer to show like how many days but then it's like the video would go up the following week if you guys wanted to like see you know how my hair look and I don't want it to take too long and then for two I really don't mention to you guys um how long the product lasts um and stuff like that because we all have different hair types so a product might last longer on me and might not last long on you and also we all live in different like climates so that's affecting you know how many days i get as well if you live in a colder place and i live in a humid place and then my hair is affected by humidity my wash and go is not going to last as long as yours is if you get what i'm saying so i try not to um do too much information in that way because i don't want to steer you guys away from the product my goal is to really show you how the product goes on to the hair which i mean longevity is a part of it but we're all going to have different results so me telling you oh i got two days is going to make you be like oh i don't want to use it and then you might use it you might get five so um okay it's one on hand dude okay yeah so all right it's it's a sally's nearby so i could check that out too but yeah so um i'll still mention to you guys like in the live stream because it's fresh on my mind um and i'll tell you guys but i don't think i'm going to make a dedicated video on each product of how long it lasts and stuff like that because there's so many different factors that go into it um and i really don't want to discourage you from using it if you get what i'm saying plus down here my wash and goes have been um no, I haven't tried that yet, but I did see that at the um, hair spot. Um, I don't want, you know, what was I about to say? Oh, I've been getting different results down here from what I get back home, too. I get longer wash and goes back home. So, um, that's kind of the reason why I see you guys ask me that a lot, and I just wanted to explain why I don't do it. But Pantene um, only gave me two days down here I had to go over top of my hair with a little bit of gel um, because it just wasn't holding up. And by the next day, I just went ahead and washed my hair. So I barely got three days. But that was the same with the um, Cantu. If you guys seen Cantu, I did that one down here too. And I only got, what, two days from Cantu? Mm -hmm. Like, I didn't, I haven't been getting past two days down here. So it's, it's kind of hard. I think, uh, Going back to gels and mousses while we're down here will give me longer styles. But mm -hmm. if we're just doing a no gel wash and go, I don't think I'm going to get past two days, y'all. Mm -hmm. Yes, mention it. Okay, I definitely will. So, um, the heat in Virginia just feels as bad. I think you need gel down there. Yeah. Um, do you have a favorite out of all of them? Um... So far, my favorite, just judging on back home, because everything has worked differently down here. Like, even Camille Rose, I only get two days down here. So, it's it's real, y'all. Um, but back home, when I had, like, my true, true, like, four or five day wash and goes, I would definitely say Camille Rose, Jane Carter, and... Um, what else gave me a really bomb result? And the black uh, castor oil and flaxseed gel. Those are like my top three wash and go results. Um, mm -hmm. Have you tried moisture? Nope, haven't tried that yet. So make sure you leave a real comment um, down below so I can add that to the list um, so I know, you know. And hi, uh, Millie. <laughs> I can't respond to your text, but I just see you. <laughs> um, uh, curl butter. Let me see. It's everything. All right. Yeah. So make sure y'all leave in real comments too, Amanda, so I can um I won't forget it. Did we discuss revisiting products that you previously? No. Um. So you guys like how I'm mentioning that Jane Carter and uh, Camille Rose didn't really work. Do y'all want to see me use it down here because it is a different climate, or would that be too much? Or we could do like a battle, like a battle of the best, like split my hair down the middle and do like Camille Rose on this side and Jane Carter on this side. Mm -hmm. We could do something like that. That would be cool if y'all want to see that. I need to know. So, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, y'all right too fast. 
Alright, <laughs> so next week, hey, you try to cream in nature and moisture and shine. Alright, y'all want to see cream in nature next week? Who wants to see that? Let me know. Let me know. Okay. I need to know so I know what to pack. Where you going, Erica? That's a good idea. That would be cool. So are y'all saying yes to the half so I know... Um, we do a lot of body this week, true. That's going up uh, either tomorrow or Friday. I'm talking about for next next week's picks. We always do like for the following week. So for next week, do y'all want to see a battle? Will my curls pop, or do y'all want to see um, a whole different product? But I think y'all are saying yes to the battle. think you should see the battles to the end but we don't know when the end of the series gonna be <laughs> we just going i think we should do like a bet yeah i think a battle will be cool so far because we've done what 17 episodes <laughs> you said okay okay <laughs> i love you Gia. you're so funny I would like to see a battle. Yeah, because we know that those two gave me, like, the best results. So, put them to the test down here where I really haven't been getting past two days. I think that's a great idea. Yes, the humidity is very different. First battle, Camille versus Jane. All right, cool. That way I ain't got to spend no money this week, y'all, because your girl broke. <laughs> but, um... Love you too, boo. Um, so, yeah. All right, we'll do that. That'll be fun. Because I definitely want to see, too. And then um, I'm going to go out to the beauty supply store and Sally's tomorrow. And so y'all say get mousse and a leave-in with Lotta Body. Because mousse will probably be good, too, down here. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. So yeah, a lot of body will, will go up tomorrow or Friday. I got deep conditioner in my hair that I still need to rinse out. Um, I really want to see Crema Nature, but I doubt. No, I've seen the new, um, in that store I was telling you about, I've seen the Crema Nature in there. Me and my mom saw it the other day, and I was like, oh, they have a whole new line. Um, Crema Nature, it's like white and orange packaging. Wait a minute, what you say? Were you able to get... Um, I haven't used it while I was down here. The Eco Styler Gel yet? I haven't used it. Um, but it probably will work. Oh, thank you. No, I still have the one that I bought. So, yeah, I'm only used it that one time. So I still got a lot of that gel left. But I appreciate you saying you would ship it to me. Um, where are my natural hair down? It did not work well for me. The humidity. Yeah. It's definitely a struggle trying to figure out what products, you know, to use in different temperatures and climates and all that. Can you do half mousse, half custard? Um, it's up to y'all. Do y'all want to see that? Do y'all want to see me split a lot of body down the middle? And do half um, mousse and leave-in and half um, leave-in and custard? Or uh, what are y'all thoughts on that? Because I haven't bought the products yet, so... Just let me know. Ooh, my arm getting tired. Sounds crazy. I like the mousse and custard. The mousse and custard together? Hmm. So a mousse and a gel. No leave-in? No, nothing underneath? That's not going to be drying? Hmm. But we got some lot of body stuff, don't we? I think you got the custard. I have custard and a. Oh, in. half and half, I meant. Oh, okay. I was about to say, girl, that sound like <laughs> the <Yeah>. tangle mess. <laughs> um, my wash and go from Saturday still popping. Are you trying to make me jealous or something, Erica? <laughs> I'll just play. Um, 
Yeah, I was saying that last week. Like, air drying has changed my life. And I used to air dry back in the day. So, I think just watching YouTube videos, too, kind of changed the way you do your hair. And I've seen a lot of people diffusing. So, I was doing that for a while. But air drying is, like, my curls even dry different. Like, it's crazy. I love air drying so much now. I don't really diffuse at all. Not together. Yeah. Um, I remember you said you were getting braids no i'm still doing the faux locks um rochelle i'm just not sure when i want to do it yet um i was thinking actually about doing it in september when i go to uh, fashion week because the humidity in new york is crazy and last year i did long curls and my hair kept messing up so bad like it was getting on my nerves and it was killing my vibe so um i think i'm gonna do the faux locks in September. I think so. But I'm definitely going to do them though. Shinier and feels different. Um, I hate it. Here down there. Yeah. Hey Wanda. What's up girl? Can you put eco style on your hair without a leave-in? Um, the green one. Um. Hmm. That's a good question. Have any of you guys used the Olive Oil Eco Styler without anything underneath? Just solely just the gel? I know I haven't. But I've seen, um, who did I see do that? I seen Natural Nisi a long time ago do that. And it looked pretty good. It was kind of flat though. And like the first day or two, it was kind of flat. But you can it's moisturizing i just don't i always put something underneath of it i've never used just gel by itself um but i mean i don't know okay so gia's saying don't somebody else is saying to me their hair crunchy i have too brittle yeah that's what i was thinking too like i mean I wouldn't because it, it still is gel even if it's natural or whatever it's still gel so I would still recommend just using maybe a lightweight leave-in or something like that you don't have to use something heavy like a butter but at least use something what is the thickest butter hmm what is the thickest butter I've used that's a good question Eden Body Works was pretty thick. Um, mm. Damn. <laughs> you stumped me with that one. <laughs> um, In between... I think Eden Body Works. Like, that's like the thickest that's coming to my mind right now. Because, like, extra butter from Uncle Funky's... Uh, no, like, I was thinking as I am too, but, uh, you ever thought about color? Um, I have, but I'm just really scared that it's gonna mess up my hair. And I already have different curl patterns anyway, and so, I don't know. i just rather, uh, wear a wig or something if I want some color. Um, it's not always about thickness. Uh, Eden, yeah, like... I'm trying to think because the As I Am Double Butter, that is thick, but it's still, when you put it in your hands, when you rub it down, it melts down really, like, fast. Um, as far as, like, the Eden, like, if y'all ever, like, scoop that, like, it is thick. I think Eden Body Works is, like, the thickest in, in consistency. Now, like, um, Extra Butter from Uncle Funky's is good. Um... What else? The As I Am is good. The hair butter from My DNA is really good. But, yeah, I think that's the thickest one that I can think of. Um, good girl. I regret it sometimes. Yeah, you have to, like, really take care of it when you have color. And not that I don't take care of my hair. I, I just, I'm scared, to be honest. I've used a curl maker by itself. And... Usually with eco. Okay. Vaseline. What? <laughs> Put Vaseline? What? 
I'm confused. It's <laughs> Are you talking about real Vaseline, Jen? Wait a minute. I'm confused. I'm sorry. I'm confused. Vaseline used for dry skin. Can we talk about hair? You want moisture? <laughs> for the summer um i disagree i think you can use it's just all in the way you apply the products too um i don't feel like thick butters like you only have to use in certain you know seasons and stuff like that uh oh i was making a comparison oh okay because <laughs> you know y'all writing so much I'm scrolling nervous. trying to read and all I see was Vaseline I'm like what you talking about Vaseline mm. <laughs> but okay <laughs> you was talking about like <laughs> petroleum products <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry oh <laughs> uh, man y'all blessed to have this info when I was natural <laughs> Jerry curl spray. <laughs> yeah, no, honestly, it is um it like the natural hair movement is amazing because we're still learning every day. Like I'm still learning, you know. And back when I went natural too, I didn't have YouTube. I didn't have, you know, all of these people telling me about it. I just went natural because I just stopped getting perms. Like I didn't know I went natural per se. I just was like, oh, okay, my, I don't want perms anymore. And that was just it. And I started doing my hair by myself. Like, just experimenting, trying to do my hair. Get your finger out of here. <laughs> <laughs> With her help. But, you know, those flat irons, I, I take credit for that. Thank you. But, um. Whatever. But, yeah, you know, now we have all this information and we can really learn how to take care of our hair so that it really flourishes and looks the like the best like mm -hmm. it can look you know so um she's right about that wait a minute what y'all talking about mm -hmm. my hair would stand up if someone tried to put it uh. <laughs> what <Water and> a vaseline <laughs> no but you know what was kind of like vaseline day. um that uh the, the no not the not just the grease though but the coconut oil the uh Oh, uh, what was that? It was in a blue magic. It was that blue grease. The blue magic, y'all. The coconut oil blue magic. <laughs> oh my gosh. I know y'all had that. I know y'all had it. And you put some water and you put mm -hmm. that blue magic on there and you slick it down. Yes. I still had that blue magic. I still even put had the blue magic in one of my first YouTube videos. Talking about for my wash and go. Girl, what was I doing? Putting that blue magic on my head like that. <laughs> I wanted to tell you the same problem with allocate naturals. Yeah, I think I used too much of that allocate. I don't know what I was doing with that. It's so mad when people call a wash and go a curl, a jerry curl. Yes, it is not a jerry curl. Mm -hmm. <laughs> a jerry curl is a problem. We'll have your head late. Yes, tell me about it. I love that. I still, I think I still have it too. I don't think I threw it away. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yes, childhood memories. What else do we use? That blue magic, the pink Burn lotion. The pink lotion. Um, uh, what was that thing called? Before flat irons. The hot combs. Wave thing. A wave cap? No, it's like a wave. You put it on your hair. Oh, a crimper. Crimper, yeah. Mm hmm Jam. Oh, yes. I love Oh, they said Dax Grease. Yes. Oh, my gosh. I remember. <laughs> Baby oil. <laughs> Bergamot Grease. It's like a big, big jar. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Y'all is crazy. <laughs> you had to grease oh your God. scalp. You had to grease that scalp. Oh, what was that yellow grease? Did it smell bad? No, but, um... It was like a yellowish greenish color, like a lime green, yellowish greenish grease. Mm. 
Oh gosh, I, I think it might have been a sulfur B. Yeah, that's that, it? that stuff stink. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's it. Oh my god. That sulfur eight something. Yeah, yeah. That <laughs> was. Oh my god. Dark and lovely was the only thing around. Yep, that's true. Yeah. That is very true. Um, she swore by it, even though. <laughs> My scalp will be burning. <laughs> oh my god. That is crazy. That's all we had, y'all. And by the way, you did not get perms. You got those other ones. That's just straight. Texturalizers? Yes. And you got little kitty nah, things. it was just for me. You got the kitty thing. Just for me is a perm, though. Oh, well. Shut up. <laughs> they want to know how you're enjoying your locks she want to take them out already y'all and i told her don't have me throwing your head no more because that took don't be swinging it i'm about to put you on camera <laughs> she's ready to take them out it's she's too like much. it's too it's heavy too it's coming too from much. somebody who used to have locks for 12 years and now can't even handle having locks for uh, a week no, it's too much. It's too big. She says she want to... Um, my hair already down my back. She want box braids, but I told her that's going to be just as heavy. Or not. What do y'all think? Braids, something lighter, but... Well, I don't know. I'm going to show you what I'm looking at. I ain't doing her no more, y'all. Yes, you are. And you will love it. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> um... How long did it take? So one day we did all her individuals. I mean, her hair is really long. Her hair is like long like mine. So um, we did like 40 something individuals on Monday. And then um, she said she kept hers in for a month. That's why I'm telling her at least give me a month. Dang. I'm going to do a month. I'm going to do a um, month. And then actual locks probably took like six hours maybe something like that five six hours yeah it wasn't really um full locks are the heaviest thing i've ever had <laughs> i remember being told until... uh oh yeah <laughs> yeah i empathize that i'm gonna extension go on my hair <laughs> it feels itchy and i want to take them out yes that's, that's what problem. she's saying it's not that it's heavy for a month it's too itchy. <laughs> Already have she dry, said it's just itchy, and she has scalp. she already has dry scalp. Um, and I have dry skin, so it's so like, Amanda, you know, are box braids um better? Let me see. I think she looks nice with the locks. I don't think box braids before it wasn't heavy for me. Oh, okay, so she said the box braids wasn't heavier. No. Oh, somebody um Erica said Molly twists. They're lighter. Okay, that might be it. Yeah. <clears throat> see, this is the girl I was looking at. Let me see. I get the, I wanna Mom, get... you better keep them things in. Yeah, you better keep them see, things in. This is what I want. What's that? Those are box papers. See how she's got like the little triangles? Oh, see okay. how like that? It, yeah. Something like that. Yeah, so I have to. I'm about to um, put some stuff in her scalp to keep it from, you know, itching and stuff. That's the problem. <sighs> yeah. That's the only problem. Because she, she has dry scalp, so. That's why. Yeah, if it wasn't for that, this one, I love it. And I actually love it. It's just it. Oh, yeah. We haven't tried um, Uncle Funky's at all. And I think I haven't done that because I already I used it on my channel. Too. But um, pull it so up in the ponytail. Uncle um, no, I haven't. But that's because I've already did Uncle Funky's on my channel. But right. I could do Uncle that. Funky's down here for humidity purposes and see how that works. Because the Curly Magic, I love that gel. Yeah. Um, I think you should. It takes the itch out. The apple cider vinegar. Oh, yeah, we have apple cider vinegar. So I'll just, like, put some on a cotton ball and go in there. Um, I was going to use the defunct from Uncle Funky's. That's really good, too. Um, yeah. But uh, I have to wash the braiding hair. Oh, we didn't. What? We did. Somebody said to wash the braiding hair before you put it in. Really? Mm-hmm. We didn't do that. Hey, Crystal. Hey, girl. 
No, we didn't do that. No, we didn't wash the hair before we put but it we in. But we also <clears throat> did an extra step that we didn't need to do. What was that? Remember we put the braiding hair on, which we didn't need to put the braiding hair on. My hair is already yeah. long, but we were only doing it for the curls Right. when we didn't have to. We could have just skipped that step. Yeah, that's true. But we did an extra step that um, we know next time. I like it for the Florida weather. But so you need something down here. To be washed. Yeah, that's true. See, I didn't know that, y'all. Because, you know, I don't fool with um, extensions and stuff. So, I don't really know when it comes so to... So, what does washing it do? Fake hair. Help she it said, not itch? Yeah, for the itch. That's what they say. Really? Uh-huh. Oh, okay. Soak it in apple cider vinegar to remove the film. Oh. oh. See, y'all smart. Y'all loyal. That smart. is... So, that, yeah. <laughs> DJ Kelly. <laughs> You were small. You were small. No, that's the other movie, man. <laughs> I was trying to be DJ Khaled. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> See, this is what happens when I live stream next to her, y'all. <laughs> Just want to be in it. Want to be in the in wanna the vlog. Want to be in the backs. <laughs> oh. Excuse me. <laughs> like, hold on. Uh, I wish I knew that when I had mine. So, oh, yeah. See, y'all teaching me some stuff here. Yeah, that's good stuff right there. All right, so, because, yeah, because uh, we're either going to do the, uh, what is it called? Box braids or, or the twist. I'd rather do the braids, I think, first. The braids? The Namali twist? I, I mean, the Namali twist is probably cool, too. Either one, but I guess because I got my heart set on the box braids. Hey, what's going on? Eva? Eva Lena? 93? Were you born Eva, in, Eva, were you Eva, born Eva, in 93? Eva, Eva. Uh... <laughs> Cali for life. <laughs> yes. You is smart. You <laughs> loyal. <laughs> I love DJ Cali. <laughs> DJ Cali. Yeah. Um all right, see, yeah. And see, she got a lot too. Maybe next time it's I, We don't need to do like almost like 50. Small. No. I was trying to tell her to braid them bigger, but she was like, no, make it smaller. I know. And that's why it's so heavy too, because she got like and almost 50 locks. No, it's it's more. It's more than 50? It's more. It's like mm. close to 70, I think. Hey, girl. Yes, it has been a minute. Where you been at? I think my... Go What's going numbers. on with you? Should be like 48. 48, wow. That's like a couple extra last month. No, no, I got like 60 something. Oh. Oh, same. I made my mom make them smaller when I. Should I listen? Yep. Oh, kids. Yeah. Do it to you every time. <laughs> it's okay, but welcome back. I missed you. Nice. I miss y'all when y'all gone. I do. Yeah, that is nice. Yeah, I think what it is. <clears throat> so just to catch y'all up, if um y'all just joined it in this week, um so this week is gonna be Lotta Body. That's what we picked last week, and then next week, um uh, we're going to do the battles. So I'm gonna split my hair down the middle. Uh, the two products that I've loved the most so far, and you guys agree, Camille Rose and Jane Carter. So I'm gonna do half and half. That's what we're gonna do next week for the uh, Will My Curls Pop battle, just to see. Um, what oh, like results we get down here with the humidity? I see. I think I seen her channel. Her um, name is. Check your IG DM. Just sent a pic for your she mom. Just, okay, well, I'm gonna has. check it. Um, when we get off. Huh? You've seen her? I think so. I don't know. Sky. Among. The size of the parts for the Molly twist. Okay. This is who I was looking at though. I like her. Her name is Snatched. Bye. Thank you. I appreciate that. I'm feeling like real cute today. Mm. You feeling Excuse yourself? Me. <laughs> Excuse me. You feeling yourself? My back <laughs> up, back up, bro. Back up, bro. <laughs> back up, bro. <laughs> Get on my nerves. <laughs> Maybe I should put some background music on for you. You are the background music. Oh. <laughs> Um, did you see my wash and go with Jane Carter? No, I didn't. I think I, um, I think I followed most of y'all back, but, um, I'm gonna do that after we get off of here, too. Um, I have a better idea. A lot of probably is pretty good. 
it? What'd you say? Oh, you said you like it. Oh, okay, cool, cool. I always look so young. Oh, I know. Sometimes I be getting like 16. I be like, y'all tried it. I don't look 16 now. Don't, don't do that. Mm -mm. <laughs> but I'll take like 19. Mm -hmm. I'll take that. I'll take 19. But I be trying to take care of my skin. <clears throat> drinking water, you know. Yeah, I like a lot of body. Um, yeah, so I hope a lot of body come through for real. <laughs> Are you agreeing that they tried it? Are you trying me right now? It's like, no, I'm just playing. Mm. <laughs> I'm just playing. No, yeah. Um, <clears throat> Y'all raved a lot about Lotta Body, so I'm hoping that it does work. Are we doing half with Lotta Body, too? Did we say that? Or are we just doing <clears throat> Moose and Leaving? I think y'all said y'all wanted to see Custard and Moose. <gasps> I think that's what y'all said. If I'm not mistaken. It's been too much fun going on over here. I'm missing out on the comments. <laughs> um, but no, I got to check out Gia's Wash and Go. Erica sent me something on IG too. Are y'all all following me on IG? Y'all got to follow me on IG too, man. Styled by Kami if y'all don't know. Oh, yes, do half. Okay. That's what I thought. Water is the cure for everything. Got a headache? Drink some water. Got a breakout? Drink some water. <laughs> Behind no bills? Drink some water. <laughs> <laughs> well, I need a big ass cup of water. Gotta go to the bathroom? <laughs> drink some water. <laughs> Y'all get on my nerves. Y'all so funny. That's number one. Hey, boo. And Miss Davis. Two. She's so beautiful. Um, you should do a live on IG. Oh, yeah. I was thinking about doing a live with my curls pop. Y'all be in my brain. Y'all, we be right here with the ideas. I'm telling you, man. Oh, no. My phone's dying. Hold up. No. Um, I followed you. Okay. Let me see. What's your... Um, I do. Ooh, I'm gonna need to um email you though on the art. Is your name the same on IG so I could find you? Hold up. Um, I seen that too, Wanda. Wait a minute. What Wanda talk about? Oh, oh yeah, the new lavender. No, I haven't seen it, but one of you guys said it earlier. Um. <clears throat> oh, you do portraits? Okay. Oh. All right, I'm gonna check out your stuff because I actually was looking for um an artist for some ideas that I have. So I'm gonna definitely check out your stuff too. I still have to follow you on IG, but yeah. Girl, what you waiting on? What you waiting on? I haven't tried it, but I want to. I haven't even seen it. Um. <clears throat> This is the first time I'm hearing about it. That it's a lavender. I think, no, I think somebody might have mentioned it last week, but I still haven't seen it yet. Where is it? What stores um, is it available in? Or is it only online? That sounds like that's going to be good, though. Lavender. And who else had lavender? Um, I think Shea Moisture has a new lavender. Didn't we just see we that? Saw, yeah, I don't remember. Yeah, before. Shea Moisture has a lavender, too. Sally's. Oh, okay. And Sally's is very close. And see, that's I like getting stuff in store because I don't want to order stuff and be waiting. Um, have y'all waiting? Yeah, except for the co-wash, a lot of body is okay. The lavender is at Sally's. Okay. All right. <clears throat> that's what's up. Let me see. Let me go to Google right now and look at it. You gonna hold it for me? Mm -hmm. Oh, you're such a doll. Thanks, mom. You're welcome. All right, let. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, what is it, Camille Rose? My hand's shaking though. 
Pretty. It's nice All right, so they have a lavender crush ultra defining gel. Um, they have a white clay edge custard. Oh, they got an edge control, y'all. Um, detangling mist. Yeah, it does say at Sally's. Okay, the packaging is really pretty. It is nice. Let's see. Cause like. What are y'all favorite edge controls? I've only, only curls. like one curls, 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 the um, passion fruit and the blueberry, blueberry. bliss. Mm. Those are the only two edge controls that really hold my edges down. Like the cream of nature don't do nothing. The nothing. motions don't do nothing. Um, oh, on Jackie's. Okay. I Ask do love on Jackie's. Um, what's the one I told you about? Got to, got to be. I wanted to check that one. Got to be. That's for like black? wigs, though, ain't it? It's for your um, edge. Yeah, but I see girls use that to hold their wigs down. Really? Yeah, it's like glue. It's glue? No, it's not glue, but it's light glue. Like, it's like, oh. pull that wig and it ain't going nowhere. Oh, I see. I don't want to put that on my edges. That's, mm-mm. Oh, okay. Um, okay, yeah, this, uh... This Camille Rose line look pretty nice. Where did you find Aunt Jackie's? Aunt oh, Jackie's is so hard, hard to find. To find like the best. Aunt Jackie's is really hard to find. Um, when I was back home, it was in uh, what's that place called? Beauty for You. But I don't know if Beauty here. for Yous are all over. I know, but I was just saying. I don't. That was like really. Well, we jumped up. And where down else in the store. was that? Um, <laughs> was it Giant? No. Remember we went to Giant one day and it was in the Giant? It was it was one there was I don't know. It was in one of the supermarkets. I haven't seen the coconut line though. I've just seen the normal the line blue. from Aunt from um Aunt Jackie's. Yeah. Twenty four hour edge tamer is the best that you've used. Okay. I've never heard of that. Mm -mm. Yeah, but ch definitely check um Dollar General um, beauty for you. What's that beauty store that we just? Well, they might not have that everywhere. I don't know. Yeah, Aunt we Jackie's is definitely hard Remember to find. Remember last week we went somewhere and we saw Target? it we jumping up and down. It might have been Target. Was it Target? Yeah. Oh, okay, Target. I mm -hmm. thought it was Giant. Mm -hmm. Elegant Beauty. Hey, are you here? Yeah, cause we went to Elegant Beauty and saw. Hey, Coley, are you in Florida? Cause that's the place I went to, Elegant Beauty Supply. I was gonna say that, but I didn't think every place had an Elegant Beauty, so I didn't want to mention it for her. I was, almost broke my neck, didn't I? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I saw that. Ele I said, like, "What? Skirt, 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 skirt." <laughs> Girl, I need some friends. Oh, you in Tallahassee. That's not... Well, I don't know how far that is. <laughs> I got excited. That's a couple of hours. How you know about Elegant Beauty Supply? They have them down Oh, down. throughout South Florida. That's what mm -hmm. she said. Yeah, okay. they have them all over. Here in Maryland. Oh. Yeah. Um, But yeah, so definitely check out... Target, <clears throat> dollar stores be having it sometimes. Um, mm, beauty supplies. I uh, used to live down there. Tallahassee is seven hours away. Wow. Oh, wow. Hey. What's up, girl? I've never seen. What? Hold up. That didn't have it. Oh, I don't know, but honestly, it it is hard to find. Like I was looking for it for a while because I like the deep conditioner, and me and my mom was looking for it for a while. And I think one of the stores we just went into and we saw we start screaming in the aisle. It was crazy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, a second to get to me. Um, I'm from Oh, okay, Chicago. Mm. Um, 
Well, hold up. Some of these websites, guys, if you go on there and you, they might have a store locator. In your area, yeah. I will not be there next week. Oh, are you going to take us some products, Erica? It's been a huge time since I've caught your live. Oh, that's what's up. I'm glad you can make it. You know, we just chilling, you know. Just kicking it. Okay, so let me look on here and see if they have a store locator because I know a lot of um, products when you go on their website, they do now um, show you what stores they're in. What is this? This is, Academia. Who's that? This is not on Jackie's. I don't know. Uh, we will miss What's you, Erica. Where you going? Wait. Hold up. You leaving? Oh, you said you won't be on next week. Where you going? Hold up. Huh? Holiday. Oh, congratulations. How many years? Where you going to celebrate? It's our wedding anniversary. Oh. Uh, what is your favorite? Uh, don't know yet. Oh, that's so cute. He's surprising you. Um, favorite deep conditioner, Aunt Jackie's in control. Mm -hmm. Oh, we're gonna miss you, Erica. But I know you'll have some you'll have fun for us wherever you go. <laughs> Eight wonderful loving years. I know that's right, boo. <laughs> Oh, mic drop. <laughs> Rain drops. <laughs> drop top. <laughs> uh, oh, that's what's up. <laughs> when he takes a nap, I'll sneak. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> oh, that is so cute. see it but I'm not really actively looking either I have to look another time um, let me see <laughs> that's so funny wow um You've been doing good with your no bun. Yes, I passed this time. I'm so happy. I passed, y'all. Um, I just was probably just going to tell y'all, you know, on here or on social media. I wasn't probably going to make another video about it. But I definitely did pass this month, which I'm happy about. And I don't know if a lot of you guys were following me when I was washing my hair every day. But... I don't think I'm going to do that again, but I definitely want to uh, somehow apply water to my hair every day, like with a spray bottle or something like that, um, because my hair needs a lot of moisture, and I'm noticing that it really is dry, and when I was washing my hair every day, it was flourishing, it was soft, it was more manageable, but I just don't, that's, it's very tedious, and I don't want to do that. So, I'm still thinking, okay, I wash my hair like every four days, but in between, I will spritz it with some water every single day and see if that helps, too. <clears throat> Have I tried the aloe spritz on your hair? Nope, haven't tried that yet. Um... Yeah, I do drink a lot of water, though. I drink water. I, I don't have a problem with that. Um, it's just applying the moisture to my hair every day. I have a problem with that sometimes. I've heard good things about the rose water too, yeah. Mm hmm mm hmm Is that like a spritzer? Yeah, it's a spritz. <clears throat> Why does it keep saying 20%? I got my phone plugged up. Um, try Ello. Hold on. With the water, it's a very good moisturizer. 
Um, I have aloe in my water. Okay, so y'all all have it in your water. Moisturizer every day is too much for me also. Yeah, like, when I was co-washing it every day, I mean, I, after a while I got into it, but I haven't done it in a while, so I feel like I wouldn't be able to just jump right back into it. But I definitely would be able to just, like, spray my hair every day. That would be a lot easier for me. Um, just before bed or something like that, spray it. Um, either, like, twist it up or put in a pineapple or something, and then, you know, wake up. So I feel like that will help my hair kind of just like washing it every day but not because i mean i didn't wash it every day like with shampoo and stuff like that sometimes i didn't even put conditioner i would just always make sure i put water on it and water is like the best source of moisture so well, that's um, that on my hair my... no because you make sure it dry like my hair dry before you go to bed like, not right before, like, bed and then jumping in and go to oh, sleep. I'm okay. just saying. Because um, when I used to, when I was washing my hair every day, I did it at night. Oh, I washed okay. my hair every, every night. Right. I used to glycerin, too. Not one is great. Okay. I'm in New York, and I use vegetable glycerin and water mm. for moisture. Okay, good. Um, I love that on my hair. Mine can get yeah, my hair can get real dry real fast. Like mm -hmm. as y'all can see, when I do the wash and goes and stuff, I spray my hair, but my hair still doesn't look wet, like dripping, you know, because I have low porosity. So I can put a whole bunch of water on my hair and it will look like this. It will look dry. Or it'll dry just like that. So um I'm trying to figure out ways mm -hmm. that I can do daily moisture so that I can retain more length and it won't break off stuff like that which one I've been um uh, go to bed before get fire I love these live streams bye y'all bye true see you later boo um okay aloe based products um Make sure hair hard. I love it. Oh yeah, that's true. I mean, um, not everything works for everybody, but I love that you guys always throw out suggestions. You know, um, because it helps everybody out. It turns out like a puffball. You just gotta find um good products to use. Um, I believe everybody can do a wash and go. It just all depends on what products you use, how you're applying the products to your hair. You really have to do research on um, what, like how your hair is supposed to be when you apply it. Some people really need to have their hair soaking wet. Some people don't. Um, some people like heavier stuff, lighter stuff. So I think everyone can achieve a wash and go. It just takes time. It really does. I don't want you to just cancel yourself out and like just say like you can't do it. You just got to keep trying different methods and you know seeing what'll what'll work so came does a high puff disqualify me from a bun challenge no mm -mm. it's a ponytail a puff is a ponytail not a bun uh, do i use avocados i eat avocados <laughs> mm -hmm. but i don't put them on my hair i only did like a few a DIY mask in my natural hair lifetime. I haven't. I'm I'm lazy, y'all. So I ain't making no stuff. Sorry. Yeah, because washing goes don't work for me. But I'm gonna keep trying. Yeah, definitely keep trying. Um, the moisture it is bomb. Okay. Try avocados. But I was going to say bananas right before you um wrote that. I see somebody do something with bananas, but you really have to make sure it's, like, really mashed up or they're going to be, like, in your hair. But, um, probably, like, put it, like, in a puree machine or something. Avocado, banana, and honey. We should do that. Mm hmm For moisture. Thanks, guys. Yeah, Cass. Um, what products have you been using so far? Like, what's your hair type? Oh. Um, am I... <laughs> Are you following me on, on IG? Because I want to um, look at your hair. Alright, let's see. Instagram. I'm going to pull it up on my computer since I can't do it on my phone right now. And see, that's what I love. They be talking to each other too. Mm hmm Alright, 
Um, okay, so I'm pulling you up now. Well, I'm trying to anyway. Instagram is slow. You have to be careful if you're protein sensitive. Um, here, yeah. Too much protein. I'm not sure because I haven't really, um, like, did protein treatments and stuff like that. So, I don't really know if my hair is protein sensitive or not. Okay, what's your, um, what's your name on there? Is it the same? Pause it on her face like that. Oh, you didn't pause it. Mm mm. It's fast forwarding. Your hair loves protein. That's cool. Oh, okay. So my hair probably is protein sensitive then. Yeah. I wish. And it's crazy because the front. Um. Okay. Cast is Alright, I'm about to, about to pull you up right now. The front of my hair is low um high porosity. Wait a minute, did I type it in right? Oh, A L. Yes, you go. Yes, a bomb went off in your hair is really tight. Hmm. Um Do you watch Natural Eighty Five? Seem like y'all hair is kinda of the same. Yeah. No, well, my hair was short. Washing those didn't work for me either. My L didn't work. Yeah, my L didn't work. She wants to can too. Not sure if my hair tight is 3B. Yeah, have you you seen like your hair is like um natural 85? I just sent you a friend request. But her hair is really like hers it's shrinks like up so tight. Um, but then when you pull it, it's it's very coily. That's what your hair seems like. I don't know. It seemed like um her videos might help you a lot, a lot. I, I can't really tell, but from your profile picture, that's what it seems like. And what does... She uses, um... I don't think she uses heavy stuff. No. And she does a lot of her own... Like, and she does like, a lot of DIYs, like, too. Like, she uses, she uses shea, uh, shea butter and stuff like that. She uses flaxseed gel and okay yeah check out some of her stuff because um some of the products she uses might uh work for you too it, it really like products and application make a huge difference not only the products but how you apply them make a huge difference on how your hair uh looks so wait what y'all talking about I like that my hair is high. Um, does your hair absorb water really quickly, um, honey bee? Yeah, I didn't really like the Myel Organics, as y'all saw. Um, I have curly hair also. Washing those take a lot of work. Yeah, I feel like the tighter your hair is, uh the more you have to kind of put into it for a wash and go. Um, cause it's so coily. Check her out. Uh, what's her? Um, natural 85. So it's like natural, but it's a P instead of a T. Nap, N-A-P. T U R A L eighty five natural eighty five yeah Whitney yeah 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 I spelled it right mm -hmm. 
<laughs> Your girl can spell. But, um, I don't know. Like, this part back here is so high porosity and so coily. Like, look how much that shrinks up. And then up here is high and my hair is looser. So it's weird trying to figure out, um, you know, what works on my hair. I just have deep conditioner in it and it just dried overnight. So this is on Jackie's, nothing else. Um... It's weird trying to figure out, you know, my hair too because some stuff that might work up here doesn't really work too good back here or vice versa. But it's nothing I can do to, to change my curl pattern, so. Although it has kind of changed over time. I feel like my hair used to be a little looser. I think it's got tighter. I don't know or not but to me it seemed like it maybe because my hair was longer it seemed like it was looser but I feel like when I was a little kid my hair was a little looser I don't know mm -hmm. it wasn't like big like this like I feel like my hair would be curly but long and now it's like curly and big it's, it's weird Yeah, that's exactly what it is. The back is low porosity and the front is um, normal to high. I don't know. And then I feel like all my hair used to be high porosity. Yeah. Like it didn't take a lot for water to get into my hair. Mm -mm. I don't know. My hair has really changed. Because it seems like it takes a lot for mine. Mm-hmm. At the top, looser like yours, but the back is low and coily. Yeah, and then, like, the sides, like, under here is real tight. Like, it seems like all under is tight and all over top is loose. So, it makes it look like, like, you, you like my hair is uneven. Like, it makes it, because certain oh, yeah. curls hang longer than others. So, it makes it look like my hair is uneven. And then, when I turn to the side, it looks like a bob. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but it's not. Um, that's why I was asking y'all last week, should I, like, start putting clips in my hair when it's drying so that the bottom can stretch out? Because, I mean, the bottom... But, like, even... I want to say two years ago, if I look at some pictures like from Fashion Week and stuff when I wore my hair curly, the back used to hang long. So I don't know what happened to my hair. Yeah, I thought, um, I used to cut the front too. I used to always cut these pieces right here because I thought it was heat damage. Oh, okay, band the sections. Yeah, because if you take a look at some of my pictures from like 2015, my hair looks longer back then. Because the bottom used to hang long. Now the bottom shrinks up so much. I don't know if that's a good thing. Like maybe my hair is more moisturized now. Because I feel like um, a, a good sign of moisture is when your hair shrinks up. Like it soaks it up. But I don't mm -hmm. know. I really don't know. And that's why I don't feel like my hair has grown because now my washing goals are bigger, but they're shorter. Back then, my washing goals used to hang longer, but they weren't as big. But when I stretch it out, my hair is pretty long. Why is the TV doing that? I don't know. Somebody was asking about the deep conditioner. Um, Aunt Jackie's in control. It's, uh, Ma, yeah. you feel like doing something real quick? What? Can you go get the Aunt Jackie's? Where is it? In the, um, in the basket? Mm hmm I'm about to show you what it looks like. No, I'm about to show you what it looks like. Uh, excuse me, girl. <laughs> <laughs> 
Um, why are you walking like that? <laughs> Yo, mom is crazy. Got me working day and night. Um, that's the deep conditioner you use in the last. Um, yeah, I used I used this and I added on the leave-in um allocate naturals. But this time, this is the this is it right here. The deep conditioner. And then I just sprayed on I always double up. When I deep condition my hair, I don't only put a deep conditioner. Yeah, this is it. I only um I don't only put a deep conditioner. What I do, I do a deep conditioner and oil, either my homemade oil mix that I made, um, or I'll do the deep conditioner and a leave-in. So last week when I deep conditioned my hair, I did this and the Allocate Naturals. Yesterday when I deep conditioned my hair, I did this and I sprayed on the um, Midnight Train from Uncle Funky's. So I always double up just to give a little extra because I always leave it in my hair long, like overnight. Mm -hmm. And I'll rinse this out today. Um, so yeah, that's what I normally do. But this is always what I use first. Mm -hmm. Like if I don't use this, I'll probably use um, the, what is it? The Shea Moisture, the 10 in 1 Super Fruit Complex. It's in a pink jar or oh, I'll use the Manuka Honey one from Shea Moisture or the um all of them are from Shea Moisture actually mm -hmm. um the black Jamaican castor oil one I'll use those for deep conditioners Shea Moisture besides on Jackie's Shea Moisture is my favorite for deep conditioners I love Shea Moisture's deep conditioners I don't use their like hair products like that but I will use their deep conditioners um, but honestly, y'all, this is what I use for the most. If I'm deep conditioning my hair, I'm using this and a leave-in or something else. Um, 10 and 1 had a sulfate as their third ingredient. Oh, uh, I don't really care too much about sulfates. You, um, you know, if you're new, you'll find that out, but it's up to you. You know, whatever you like using, go for it. I don't use that one a lot. I find that I use that one in the summertime. Um, but for the most part, this bay right here, y'all. <laughs> I got so many of these, like, it's crazy. Um, I never use that. Never use that. Um, love chatting this week. It's almost two. Have to run. Okay, I will miss you. Be safe. Enjoy your anniversary. We love you. Bye, Erica. We'll see you next, next week. <laughs> you had to tell us all about it. We want to know. I know, y'all. I think, uh, think we should wrap it up, though, because we have been in here for a minute. Um, I stopped using Shea Moisture. Too many products. Um, say no sulfates. Um, I will. I'm gonna check my IG. I promise. Um, no, I have not used the curl la la. I only used the flaxseed gel from um on Jackie's. Yo, post pics. Okay. I'm gonna be stalking your IG. <laughs> um. Yeah, like I'm not a big Shea Moisture user anymore, honestly, but. Every now and then, you know, I, I'll use something from their line. Like, I haven't repurchased anything in a while. Whatever I use is because I still have it. But um, I don't even remember the last time I probably bought. I think the last time I bought Shea Moisture was last year when I was doing the wigs and stuff. That was the last time I bought one of their deep conditioners. So... Um, but yeah, y'all, what time is it? Yeah, it's 2 o'clock. So, as much as I would love to sit in here all day, um, I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. I had an amazing time talking to you guys. So, uh, stay tuned tomorrow or Friday for the Lotta Body. And then next week, it will be the battle of the best. So, um, I love you all so much. Thank you once again for joining me on this Wednesday. 
and um i will see you guys in my next video oh mom wants to say bye <laughs> Bye, guys. Have a great rest of your day.